In this video, we will be going over chart labels. Now, chart labels display information on the price plot of the chart and can be displayed in any of the four corners of the chart, either the top left hand or right hand corners of the chart, or the bottom left hand or bottom right hand corners of the chart. We can access the label settings via Configure, Preferences, Chart, Labels. And on the left hand side, you have a column here of available labels. I'm going to select a few here. We have the daily high. Now you notice here I have the right arrow button, which will move it over. We have the low, move it over, the close, and the open. Now if I want to put any of these back, it's just a matter of selecting them and hitting the or clicking the right arrow button. And if I want to move them all back and start all over, I can select them all and click on the double left arrow button. Let's add a few more here. I'm going to add ATR. Date and time. And maybe we'll do one more. Cursor price. Okay. Now on the right hand side here of the second column we have the ability to rearrange the order of this list of labels. So I'm going to put these figures together here. Actually you can also drag and drop them into position. So we have the high, open, close, and the low. And I think the ATR, I want to make that one first. And then we'll have the cursor price and the date and time. From here, we can select the properties for each label. Let's start with the ATR. So let's click on the pencil icon. We'll leave the label as is, ATR. The period is fine. We want that in the top left-hand corner. And let's put an outline, a rectangular outline. And perhaps we can make this uh, a red color. We'll click OK. The daily high, maybe we'll change this to high. Everything else we'll leave as default. The open, we can change this to open. The low, we'll change this to low. Close, we'll change this to close. Now we have the cursor price. So for these ones here, I've selected the top left hand corner from all the available positions. So one, two, three, four, five. So for this one, let's make this one the bottom left. And maybe we'll change the text color to maybe a bright green. And the date and time, we can do the bottom right. We'll leave that as well. Let's make that green as well. Okay. Um, let's also put a buy button and a sell button here. And let's place them right after the daily values. And for these ones, You'll notice these outlines are rounded. I'm going to leave these as is because that's perfect. And this one should be like a red color. Okay, that's perfect. So if we hit apply now, we hit OK. Let me just close volume here. Now you'll notice the labels with our settings in the upper left hand corner, the bottom left hand corner, and the bottom right hand corner. Now this will apply since we have set it under configure preferences then this will apply to all charts. Now, for instance, if I wanted something to show, a label to show only for a specific chart, I can double click on that chart, go to labels, for instance, and let's say for this one, I wanted the 52 week high, and we'll put that right after the sell button and click OK. You'll notice this has the high here, but the other chart here, the Apple chart doesn't have it. Okay, so anytime you 
um, either double click on a chart or right click and select chart settings labels that will apply only for this specific chart okay so that's it for this video and we'll see you in the next